Windows 10 technical preview for phone also comes with a brand new file explorer. We're going to give you a quick tour and show you what it's all about. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, Daniel Rubino here with Windows Central and we're continuing our coverage of the Windows 10 technical preview release here and I got two devices in front of me, one running a Lumia 830 based on AT&T. The second one is a Lumia 635 from T-Mobile, although I got a cool uh, shell for it that makes it look a little bit nicer. Anyway, we got it both running, and in case you're wondering on the 635, I actually have no problems running uh, Windows 10 on this. It basically feels the same as the 830, so uh, don't be any concerned. You can actually pick one of these up on at and I think, for 50 bucks now, so uh, if you're really interested in getting Windows 10 and you don't have a, uh, a phone, uh, 635 is a pretty good option. Anyway, let's talk about this File Explorer. So previously on Windows Phone 8.1, there was an app called Files, and now there's a true File Explorer that's just basically a part of um, Windows, and as you can see, it also does landscape, which is kind of nice. So this will actually uh, rotate all the way around and give you that. So how it works is basically pretty simple. I got an 830 here with a micro SD card installed. And so because of that, you can kind of see here, I'll zoom in a little bit. You can see it says this device and also the D drive. And so I can kind of switch between them. It brings up the folders. And you don't get access to the system files, obviously, right? This is just for, you know, pictures, documents, that kind of thing. But it is a little bit greater access. So if I go into, say, D and I choose music, it's going to bring up, uh, you know, I got two bands here, Periphery and Rise Against, and I can hit rise against and go into one of their albums and brings up the thumbnails too and you get your different views so you can bring up your menus here and you have your search you have a list view new folder or select so you can go through you can of course select multiple files you can hold down on anything it'll bring up this little menu here and properties actually doesn't do anything right now it doesn't look like you can open up the file with something else which i know a lot of people have been asking about but perhaps that'll come a little bit later of course you can delete it move it copy share rename etc so all pretty good stuff if you hit share it's going to open up the traditional uh, share picker that we're familiar with in windows phone 8.1 and you can send it off to email uh text messaging whatever you want to do with it so it's pretty fluid actually i'll just show you what it looks like on here so there it goes right to the share picker, which is also landscape. So you can see I have Outlook, Bluetooth, OneDrive, and any other apps that I install in here that can share media will also get this. So uh, pretty good. You also have a recent files here. So that whatever stuff you've accessed uh, recently, it'll bring up. Uh, we can do pictures. We're going to do save pictures. And so you guys see it brings up the wallpaper that I have installed on this device and everything. So overall, pretty good stuff. Um, no different really than the Lumia 635. It's running just as well here. Let me zoom out a little bit. You can see I got some music installed. Uh, same thing, everything works exactly the same as on the 830, which is really good. So uh, for those looking for greater control on Windows Phone, uh, the Windows 10 preview looks to be pretty good. The new File Explorer is a lot more full featured and it's going to continue to evolve. It's an app that can be updated through uh, the store. So Microsoft can continue to add and refine features as it goes, but it's been very stable. I've had no issues with it. So there you go. Head to Windows Central for more information. If you have any questions, leave us a comment. We'll try to get to it. Otherwise, that's it. Take care, buddy.